Every year in the tiny Texas town of Freer, thousands gather in the name of Rattlesnake. From rattlesnake skin to spitting fangs down to the direct bazaar, this South Texas festival is sure to entertain. Well, I mean, they're a very interesting animal, in my opinion. Yeah. They've been a great vehicle for me. I've been a million miles with them. But it's not just the venomous attraction that has these people traveling for hundreds of miles. It's the ambiance, food, crowds, music, good old family fun. Yeah. A tradition that has captivated this town for 50 years. If not the sounds of monster trucks and strutting strings, it's the constant rattle that keeps this party going. This is the 50th annual Freer Rattlesnake Roundup. I got involved with this roundup back in 1970. I caught a snake that was six feet three inches long. And I came and won the prize for the longest. So I got me a trophy and got me a $50 check back in 1970. But $50 was a lot of money back then. We've gotten about 6,000 rattlesnakes this year probably. Wouldn't it, it wouldn't look good if I'd have just put like. You want to come to a good event where there's good people, everybody will greet you, tell you hi, come out and see the snakes. This is the place to be. How long have you been coming to the Real Snake Roundup? Uh, since I was probably his age, about five years old. Fantastic, hadn't been here in a long time, so it's good to be home. It was cool. It's pretty bleak. I can hardly remember. But it's when the sun goes down that the real party begins. Like on Friday night when the Rattlesnake Roundup showcases some of the hottest acts in Tejano music. Saturday morning comes, so do the floats. While the Rattlesnake Roundup holds a strong tradition, so does its customary parade, where organizations of beauty queens from all over Texas travel to be part of the yearly event. Got my granddaughter with me, and she's, she gets a big kick out of this, and I get a kick out of seeing her having fun. And that's what it's all about, everybody coming out, getting together and having a great time. Well, you should just see the people gasped at the parade when they see the snakes. <laughs> to where more people will never forget about this little community of Free Texas. To remember this forever, what the Rattlesnake Roundup is all about. This snake was alive in my snake. Thank you, thank you so much. So one day I took it out, chopped its head off, skinned it out, cleaned out the hide on the on the on the flesh side, I nailed it on the board, adding the tanning solution to it, and about after two weeks of sitting there on the board, now I have a tan hide, rattlesnake skin hide. And for those too timid to handle the rattlesnakes, there's always something to do. This truck does really good donuts. As the last day wraps up, it all leads to the headliners of Saturday night's country concert. This year it's Nashville recording artist Easton Corbin. For a tradition that started 50 years ago at a gas station in a rural South Texas town to the largest roundup of rattlesnakes in the state, the Freer Rattlesnake Roundup has proven to be essential in the hearts of the people who matter most, the citizens of Freer.